Did you know that it took three centuries for women to gain access to life insurance in the U.S.? Due to the high mortality rates with pregnancy and childbirth, women were deemed uninsurable. But one woman from KPAC, Michigan, Bina Miller, wasn't willing to accept that status quo. While working as a school teacher in the late 1800s, she saw a family torn apart by the death of the mother. Life insurance would have helped them stay afloat in the event of the father's passing, but since the mother passed, there were no benefits. So the father couldn't afford to hire anyone to take care of the children. The kids were removed, placed in separate foster homes, and forced to work. Miller recognized the vital role of life insurance in tragedies like those, so she borrowed $500 to found the Women's Life Insurance Society in 1892. Within a decade, the organization had a membership of over 100,000 women, providing crucial financial security to families nationwide. Today, it still stands strong and it's headquartered in Port Huron. And that's just one of the many things that we wouldn't have without Michigan women. Stay tuned with The Gander for more.